Hey guys, and welcome back to the conclusion of 10 Ways to Experience God. So I want to jump right into it. Uh, one way you can do is get to know God with your heart and mind. Study God's word uh, with prayer. And then what I mean by study is use commentaries, do cross re references with different scriptures, and then use a dictionary if you really don't understand um, some of the meanings of the words. And you can also use um, different translations, you know, just to get a better understanding of what the word is saying and then also get to know him on an intimate level sing songs of loving kindness thanks thanksgiving you can also use worship instrumental songs um, to dance before the lord as well and the scripture references that you can go to is matthew chapter 12 verses 28 to 34 and then luke chapter 10 verses 25 verse 28 and again that was the step of um getting to know god on an intimate level number two love you can experience God through love basically just think about God constantly ponder on how you can please him on a daily basis so for example um, you can say you know God I love you I'm thinking about you I delight in you I enjoy being in your presence and scripture references that you can go to is John chapter 14 verses 15 and then Ephesians chapter 3 verses 18 through 19 and the last and final step it's not a fun one but embracing the transformation of god um basically this goes against our flesh and our nature because we like how we are we don't like changes we don't like um things just going against our very natures and it's just natural but when god comes in you know he wants to make us in his likeness in his glorious light so basically when it comes to transformation um, there's an inward change that manifests into the physical. You can find that in Colossians chapter 1, verse 10. And again, that's Colossians. Um, second one is drawing near to God. Ephesians chapter 2, verses 13. And then the last one is reflecting God's glory. And you can find that reference in 2 Corinthians 3, verses 18. And the last one is, guys, I want you to really look at this picture. It's a very powerful picture. Um, that I found and what I need you to do it's pretty basic I want you to just look at the picture and then um, in what way can you experience God in this photo I really need you to use your imagination use metaphors and then once you really get a good look at the details of this picture then you see the little boy picking out certain pieces of garbage that um, is pleasing to his eye and that he sees very interesting and I, I gave you a hint um, on how you can um, see this picture and how you know you can experience God in this photo but the last step is name three ways that this can be a good spiritual experience for you on a personal level so again look at the picture um, number two in what ways can you experience God in this photo and three name three ways that this can be a good spiritual experience for you thanks guys so much and um, I look forward to seeing you with the next video thank you and be blessed take care